What's up dudes? Just a short one here for you that hopefully will help you out. Hopefully you'll find this. Uh, I couldn't find anything about this on YouTube. A 1993 uh, Chevy 1500. It's a OBD1 system. So, excuse the mess, but it's been kind of uh, on the fritz here lately. So I haven't been driving it as much and I haven't been paying it as much of, of attention as I normally do. And uh, anyway, this is how you normally get your codes. You jumper A and B. Hopefully you can see that. And that's basically the limit of it. You can buy some stuff apparently to plug in your phone to it and turn it into a scanner of sorts, but I don't think it does as much as people, uh, it doesn't do as much as OBD2. So you're limited on what you can find out and data logging and all this sort of stuff. But everybody, most people know about that on these OBD1 systems. That's not the secret. The secret is, is there's a technique or a uh what would you say a mode that they call field service mode okay and what that is is that's when you go ahead and start the engine it tells you based on the series of blinky lights whether it's in open loop or closed loop you can read that there if it's rapid flash it's open loop if it's closed loop it's one per second so um Anyway, that can help you do further diagnostics. I'm not gonna explain everything because then the video wouldn't be a short, but uh, maybe you should check out the hands-on channel and you can learn stuff like this. Now first, I'm not gonna start it right away. I'm gonna reset my TPS. So I'm just gonna turn the key on. I just uh, took it out and cleaned it. Turn the air off and all that, turn the key on. And just letting it sit here like this should set, reset the TPS. So now, it's just showing me one, one, two, which is normal. It means everything's normal. So we're gonna go ahead, once it does that three times, so now we're gonna start it up. And now it's showing me that right now on initial start cold, the rapid flash means it's an open loop. So just wanted to give you guys this little quick tip here. Hopefully it'll help you out. Cause like I said, I'd never heard of this. And there are some certain circumstances where you need to know this, uh, you know, for other diagnostics to help you find out. I'm sure what I'm having a problem with is it's running rough intermittently and running real weak sometimes, like it's running on half the cylinders or something or half the fuel. So trying to sort this out, hopefully this will help you guys figure out your problems. Uh, subscribe to the Hands-On channel. Hit the thumbs up if you like it. See you later, guys.